all this stuff that's been so frequently missed due to the clouds of fear. When really, looking right through all the fears without being overtaken with the, by them, letting dissolve by feeling your own presence, connecting with your own presence, not letting all the exponential take us over. No. Yeah, but will. I'm so terrified by my job. I'm so terrified with walking out of my job. Same thing applies. Hmm. All right. I might not be able to pay my bills. I got a family to feed. I got others depending on me. You know, fair enough. So let's take a breath. Let's step back from everything. Let's honor all that stuff. All right. Let's not deny any of the above. Let's take a breath. Welcome in all of oneself. It's even right now, connect with you. It's not the head, let the head level try to figure you out or itself out or the whole universe out for a minute. Let's connect with you. Because I promise you, the head's not going to figure it out. The head's part of what got you trapped in the first place. The head's done a great job trying to figure it out. That's part of why we're addressing fear in the first place. Because the head has been a great job creating it in the first place. But nevertheless, it's done a great job trying to protect you. So now, wow. Hmm. All right, family. Show me the way beyond the tsunami. All right, higher levels, creative levels, manifest levels, divine presence, radiance, universe as a whole. Whew. Show me what else you have in store for me. Now, before we go any further, let's also ask ourselves, fear or no fear? Fear or no fear? Am I willing to take and make the leap, no matter what. Now, I share this, I say this, because I've done this. I don't share anything with you that I haven't looked right in the eyes with. I've walked through it, I've done it, I live it, and I've overcome it. Many will say, oh, well, Will, that's you, you're walking, blah, blah, blah. Who cares? If I cut my arm, my body's going to bleed. I have one, too. Oh, Will, you have so much assistance. You're right. But so do you. The universe is not biased. What a bummer that would be. Will, we love you more. Everyone else, well, I don't know about them. Well, and I share this with my angel quite frequently. I so, you know, honey, I'm taken care of. I don't know about you, but, <laughs> and I tease her about that when we're driving, especially through Red Rock. <laughs> and it's a long joke that we have. So, you know, honey, uh, this side of the car is taken care of. I don't know about yours, but <laughs> it's a joke. Okay. But the universe is not biased. The same is true for you as it is for me. Now, the only difference here is I'm not afraid of fear. The only difference here is I'm willing to make the leap. Fear or no fear. I'm not going to let it hold me back. I'm not going to let it hold me down. I'm not going to let it suffocate me. I'm not going to let anything control me. I'm not a rebel, but I'm not a conformist. I'm divinity, and so are you. 